Hello everybody. Let's call today's video ULTY the update. I put out a video on the day that this fund launched and I told everybody, of course it wasn't financial advice because I'm just a car mechanic, but I said in my opinion ULTY is different when you compare it to the other yield max funds because they own the stock and it says here that they write um, well they try to generate monthly income from a portfolio of covered call strategies so again I'm kind of new to this but I can look up the definition of covered calls and it says here that covered call is um, stock shares you already own it's a strategy um, it's an options strategy that focuses on stock shares you already own. So if you know anything about yield max, you know, Coney and Tesla and Apple, uh, all of their funds use synthetic positions, meaning that they don't actually own the stock. So the definition of a synthetic position is uh, trading positions created to emulate the characteristics of another position, meaning that they don't own the stocks. So what excited me about this was, hey, they're going to own the stocks and they're going to do covered calls on stocks. And I'm afraid to do options trading. And that's why I buy yield max funds because they give me the opportunity to participate in the upside of options trading without doing it myself. So on day one, I showed you guys this on launch day. This was a, a spreadsheet of their holdings and it showed that they owned these individual stocks and that they were actively writing covered calls on these positions that they owned. Then over the weekend, when I downloaded their holdings, it looks completely different. It shows that they don't own the stock. They're actually doing calls and puts on the different um, stocks, uh, you know, that they, they don't own. So it looks like they went back to how they normally do things, which is a synthetic position. So... What I thought was unique about the stock may not exactly be true. And if when I looked at the fund overview, I don't know if they changed this or if I just missed it. But it says ULTY also provides direct or indirect exposure to the share price returns of the underlying security. So the underlying security means the stock. And I would say that direct means that shares that they own or indirect shares that they are using a synthetic position on. So this is just my interpretation uh, of the situation. And uh, Corey in our Discord, she put out an hour long video and she actually emailed uh, the Yield Max fund manager because when I tried to contact them, I went to their customer service and I filled out a contact form they didn't get back to me. I basically got an automated response with a link to their frequently asked questions, which was not very helpful. And I'm really kind of disappointed because out of my 17 positions, five of them are yield max ETFs. So maybe it's time that I lighten my load um, on the whole yield max um, game. But that's just my own personal opinion. And again, this is not financial advice. But I wanted to clarify that basically I don't know what's going on. Um, ULTY I thought was different that as in that they owned the stock shares. But now it appears that they will deploy um, both types of strategies. And we're going to have to see. We're going to have to let it run for a while and see how things work out. But again... If you're interested in, in a more detailed um, standing of where we're at today, I recommend that you uh, visit, um, I believe it's called Happy Camper with Dividends. And it's Corey who owns that channel. And she came out with a video. Um, it's about an hour long that 
talks more in detail about what is going on. So I hope this update was helpful and I thank you for watching and we'll, we'll talk to you again soon. Thank you.